it might not be the morning <laughs> hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel so today i'm going to do a video that i saw on sophie louise's channel which is spending my day in alphabetical order so i'm lazy i can't be bothered to figure out the alphabetical order for myself so i put it into a random list alphabetizer online and i was hoping that i'd be able to wash my hair and then blow dry my hair but unlucky for me the first thing on my list today is to blow dry my hair and brushing my hair isn't until a little bit further down, so now I'm going to end up with really knotty hair. But yeah, we'll crack on with blow drying my hair. It's currently, currently 8.30 in the morning and Josh is still in bed, but I'm about to blow dry my hair. So that's nice. And just like that, my dry hair is still dry. So luckily for me, the next thing to do now is to actually have breakfast. I was kind of worried because for some reason I don't know my alphabet at 22, nearly 23 years old, that I'd have to brush my teeth before breakfast and I'm not one for doing that. But I get to go have my breakfast now, which is good. And luckily, alphabetical order still means I can put my cereal in before my milk because I ain't about that milk before cereal life. <laughs> So now that I've had my breakfast, it's time for me to brush my hair and then I can brush my teeth. That's my hair done and now time for brushing my teeth. So the next thing on my list of things to do is super fun and that's cleaning. I'm thrilled. <laughs> so the next thing for me to do is cleaning. So I need to wash these pots here. But I've already wiped down the sides and everything. So it's literally this and then a couple bits in the living room. And then we'll move on to the next task. So I've finished cleaning now. If you saw that. <laughs> and the next thing on my list is Game of Thrones because there's spoilers absolutely everywhere. So I had to, instead of just putting watch TV and watching it later, cheated a little bit so I could watch it this morning because I can't avoid the spoilers forever. Half nine and we're gonna just put on Game of Thrones. And then I'm not sure what's next on my list, but I'll have a look and check back in. So I've just finished watching Game of Thrones. The next thing on my list is to get dressed. And then after that, it's go to town. So I'm gonna get dressed and then we're gonna walk into town. I think Josh is coming with me. Josh, you coming with me? Just said no, but he's coming with me. So yeah, I'll check back in with you guys once I'm dressed and I'm walking to so town. Me and Josh told you he would come with me. I go into town. No choice. Finished shopping or going to town. And we just found, what did we find on the floor? So I'm back home now. And the next thing I'm gonna do is a little haul of everything I got when I went to town slash go to town. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so H is the next and then I'm not sure what comes after H, hoping it's lunch soon because I am starving, but we'll see. So the first thing I got was these shoes, which I need for work. I mean, they're not my everyday cup of tea for shoes, but they do for work. And then this is everything we bought. So because it's coming up to summer, I got this for Frankie just to help cool him down. I got some beans for my dinner because I'm going to have beans on toast. I got some brown sugar and some peanut butter chips and just chocolate chips because I'm going to make some cookies. I've got chicken fries. Josh is making some recipe for tea. I got this gold rejuvenate and plump lip mask. Lion bars. New notebook for my job. How cute is this? <laughs> but yeah, for, I need to start writing things down. I got some eye patches, also gold and another gold mask. I got these new, well, Josh got these noodles. This is also for tea. Some fabric softener, some rice noodles, some bleach cleaner, and some tomato and chili chutney. So that is everything we bought when we went to town. Look how cute he is in his little vest. Oh, Frank, he's so cute. So I put the shopping away. As you can see, it's not there anymore. And now it's time to make lunch. So I'm gonna have just these 
beans and sausages on toast because I'm basic. <laughs> so like I've already said, the last, last, the next thing for me to do is just to eat my lunch, which is here. I'm just having beans on toast. Sorry about the noise outside. Josh is outside cutting the grass. And then next on my list after this is to make cookies, which I'm not mad about. It's going to be the first time I'm making cookies. So rude. Sorry, the lawnmower is probably really loud. But like I say, it's going to be the first time I'm making cookies. I've never made them before, so it could be a disaster, but it's next on my list. So this is what my finished cookie dough looks like. And these are the balls on the baking trays ready to go in the oven. It says that for the Millie's experience cookies, it only takes seven minutes in the oven. So I'm just going to try them for seven minutes and see how they turn out. Fingers crossed, they turn out good. <laughs> so my cookies are done now. This, these two have burnt on the edges, which is annoying. But this one looks amazing. And so does that one. <laughs> so this is just the first batch. Like I say, there's still some dough and that left there. But I'm just going to let these cool down for a little bit. And the next thing on my list is... So the next thing on my list is to do my makeup. And I'm also going to be doing each step of my makeup also in alphabetical order. I know this is also a challenge in itself. People just doing their makeup in alphabetical order. I think the only one I've seen so far is Nikki Tutorials. I think she might have been the one who started it. Her or James Charles. And in her video she actually managed to make herself look good. But my makeup skills are very, very, very limited. Um, so I don't think mine's going to look that great. So... It'd be fun nonetheless and i know this video i said this morning it's inspired by sophie louise this is how she did it in her video she just incorporated her makeup into that which is what i'm going to be doing so the first step of doing that is to apply a blusher and then bronzer so the only cream blusher that i actually own is this which is like a really really pale pink color If you could even see that and then I'm using this the benefit cheek parade and I'm going to be using the color California because that's the darkest blusher that's in this palette so I'm going to stick that onto this and hope that it shines through the foundation so next is for blusher so again I'm going to try and apply a slightly more than what I usually would in the hopes that it's going to shine through my foundation. So next on the list is brow products. It's literally just started absolutely hammering it down outside. I have to walk the dog later in my pyjamas. And I'm not looking forward to that if it's chucking it down with rain. I'll be honest. And next is concealer. I apply some on my cupid's bow, on the tip of my nose, a little bit down the centre. Onto my forehead. Obviously under my eyes. Just all the normal places where you put concealer really. So that's my concealer done and next on my list is eyeshadow and the annoying part is that eyeshadow primer comes after eyeshadow so <laughs> that's going to be fun. I'm just thinking like imagine if this is the best my makeup's ever looked and I've just been doing my makeup in the completely wrong order this whole time. <laughs> the rain just got even heavier. You're probably going to be able to hear it soon. So now that my eyeshadow is done like I said before the next step is actually to use eyeshadow primer so what I'm going to do is kind of I have no idea how to cut crease but I'm going to put a little bit of eyeshadow primer on my lid and then hopefully fill that in with highlighter later and cheat a little bit hopefully it works so I'm just going to pop some of this on the back of my hand and then use a brush to apply it to my lid So that's the primer applied now. The next thing on my list is foundation. 
Now I'm just using a really old foundation for this. I don't want to use any of my best foundation and waste it. Um, so I'm pretty sure I don't even have enough for a full face. So I'm just going to scrape some of this on my face with the stick and just try and blend it out as best I can. I'm going to do the bottom of my face first. Trying not to go over the bits where I've already applied the bronzer and the blusher in the hopes that I don't smudge it. So now for highlight, then lipstick, mascara, powder, primer, setting spray. This rain is making living life in alphabetical order really not fun. I'm really dreading having to go walk the dog in my pyjamas in the rain. So that's my highlighter applied. Now for lipstick. Next is mascara. Next on my list is powder. And next, next I've got to do primer. And everyone else has got away with this by, well not everyone because I've not seen everyone's videos, but some of the videos I've watched have got away with this by using a spray similar to this as a primer. I haven't got that. The only primers I've got are in these nice little squeezy shoes. So my camera and memory card just said it's full, but the last two steps I had left to do was primer, which I was just saying, I'm not sure if it caught it on camera or not, that I, some of the videos I've seen have used a bottle similar to this as a primer spray, which I don't have, and that seems to make it so that it doesn't, doesn't ruin all your makeup. The only thing I've got is this, the Benefit Professional, and I've already squeezed them on my finger, and now I'm going to have to rub this over the top of my foundation. So that's my primer applied after everything else. And the last step is just to apply some setting spray and I'm using this, the All Nighter Urban Decay Setting Spray. Just like that nicely primed face. So that is my makeup done in alphabetical order. To be honest, I was expecting it to look worse. I don't think I've done too bad. So this is just a video with the flash on and the camera the other way around, just so you can see what my makeup's actually looking like. I'm hoping it's not that bad. <laughs> so the next things I get to do is moisturise and get into my PJs. Pretty sure it's moisturise first, then PJs. So I've moisturised now and done my makeup especially for me to get into my pyjamas and the next thing I get to do is read and then I can remove my makeup. So I usually just do reading on my phone, I've got it on iBooks because my iPad broke. It's currently 10 to 4, I've just finished my makeup and I'm already in my pyjamas ready for bed and I've still got to read, remove my makeup and then like shower, skincare and all of that stuff before I can even have my tea. So I've got a lot to get on with really. The next thing for me to do now is to remove my makeup. I've just been trying to take some pictures for a thumbnail and I did it the other way around with a flash on and then I noticed this, like you can see here, there's bits where it must have, when I put the primer on it, it must have just rubbed off the foundation. So I'll insert a picture now <laughs> of what my makeup actually looks like. It looks horrendous and I cannot wait to take it off. This eye is watering so badly, it's ridiculous. So yeah, once I've taken off this makeup, I can have a shower and then apply my skincare, which is nice. Um, the only thing is, washing my face isn't actually until later on, so I'm just going to have to take off my makeup with wipes and then try and clean it in the shower. But I can't properly wash my face with face wash, etc. until later on before I go to bed, which is always fun. So like I've already said, I'm going to have to take my makeup off just with makeup wipes. I'm using these from Primark. They're the prep and perfect glow wipes so i should have used that for my primer prep but then just wiped all my makeup off <laughs> i 
I'm just kidding. But yeah, I'm going to remove as much of this makeup as I can with these wipes before I get in the shower. So I've removed as much of the makeup as I can with them wipes. And like I said, I'm just going to have a shower. So I'm just going to turn that on. I'm not going to film me in the shower, but you'll know I've had a shower because my hair will be wet. So I'm out of the shower now. You can probably tell since though my hair's wet because it's been washed. And the next thing I'm going to do is skincare. I put all of my skincare again into alphabetical order. So the first thing I need to do is apply eye cream. And then next is to apply this gold sheet mask. Now that I've done the face mask, which has been left on for 10 minutes, it's now time to take this off, rub it all in, and then apply the next thing, which is facial oil. There's literally so much liquid left behind. I feel like I don't need facial oil right now, but you've got to do it the way the alphabet tells you to. The next thing to do is to apply the lip mask. So, oh, <laughs> so glad to take that off. It smells so artificial and fake. It's horrible. But the next thing for me to do is apply my facial moisturizer. Or just moisturizer. And that's it until I get to wash my face tonight. And my face feels horrendous because obviously there was loads of liquid left over from the mask and then the oil. And now this. Usually I would spread out my skincare, but obviously I've had to do it all in one go due to the alphabet. What I need to do is have my snack, which is just a lion bar. Frank. <laughs> so I'm gonna have this and then it's time for tea. So it's finally time for tea and Josh has made this chicken stir fry thing with noodles. It's nice anyway. But I'm just going to eat this and then we'll move on to the next stage. My chicken just fell off my fork. <laughs> so the next thing on my list before walking the dog is teeth. So it's 20 past 7 at night. As you can see, it's wet and miserable. Hey Josh. Hey. And we're just taking the dog on a walk. And like I said earlier, I have to walk the dog in my pyjamas after I've already had a shower and it's raining. So that's nice. That's nice. So I've braided my hair because as you can see from this, it dried absolutely crazy because I left it to dry naturally. So I just put it in a little braid out of the way. And the second to last thing for me to do is to wash my face, wash up all the skincare that I did earlier. Seems a bit backwards. And then I've just got to watch TV slash YouTube and then it's bedtime. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wash my face and then I'm just gonna lay in bed and watch things on my phone. She's using this Lizelle cleanse and polish. So now that I've washed my face, like I say, the only thing left to do is to watch TV. So I'm gonna end the video here. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you did, please make sure you like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Thank you.